Okay guys, so here is my beauty section. This is my little section that I have in my apartment, as I mentioned to you guys. For those ladies who don't have their own personal room where you can have, you know, the elaborate beauty section with your clothes, your shoes, and all your makeup. If you don't have the space where, you know, you have multiple rooms that you can use one personally for yourself, then you can get a cute little corner and create your own little beauty section like I did. Okay, so I'm going to start off first with the mirror. This is my Hollywood Vanity Girl mirror. I bought this when I moved into the apartment. Uh, on top, underneath, you'll see a desk that I bought from Ikea. Uh, I think I paid about $29 for this desk. As you know, when you buy Ikea, you have to put everything up yourself. It was very easy, very simple, so that's no biggie. I also bought this cute little pink chair. I think I paid about $20 for this chair, also from Ikea. Um, I have this little compartment uh, storage that I bought from Target. I keep all of my extra brushes up here. Uh, I have a brush kit, a traveling brush kit that I keep there. Here's some extra brushes, my makeup removal. Uh, in the next drawer, I think I have like all my camera stuff, uh, extra camera, uh, chargers for batteries. In the last drawer, I think I have like my witch hazel, my milk of magnesia, uh, stuff that I clean my brushes with. Um, over here, as you can see, here's a couple of my wigs. I put them on top of my makeup uh, kit that I usually use when I'm going to do makeup jobs. I uh, haven't found a great place to put my wigs yet, so I store them on top there for now. Um, okay, back to my desk. I have my B. Dillium brushes. I have them in this little cute little jar. I think I pay like $3.99 for this jar. I got it from Target. Um, over here, I have the Mason jar, and those have my Sigma brushes. Um, I got the Mason jar from Walmart. I bought like a case of 12, so I took one and I used it to store some of my brushes. Um, this does have a compartment that you can open up. And here you will see my makeup. All right, guys, so this is a favorite, this is my favorite part of the video. I'm gonna show you guys how I got this entire look. Um, I'm gonna just have a quick seat so you guys can get a really good look. Okay, so right here I have like my blush, a couple, what is this? This is my Styla eyeshadows. I have my Benai powders in different shades. This is Chestnut, this is Ebony. Um, I have my MAC Studio Fix right here in two colors. I have the MAC Concealer. I have the MAC Eyeshadow. I have like a Makeup Forever powder. I have an Iman powder. I have my palettes back there. Uh, the 10 color concealer palette. I have Urban Decay palette. As you can see, I have the NYX palette. I have some... Uh, eyelashes what's back there I have the sleek contour kit um, right here is where I keep all of my um, my lip liners and my NYX jumbo sticks and my sharpener over here I keep my mascara uh, my Anastasia pencils and the, the brow the brow wiz and what else let's see I have the liquid liner eyeliner so I keep all that stuff there over here as you can see I have all my lipsticks my MAC lipsticks I have key your lipsticks um, I don't have much lip gloss but over here I have couple of stuff. I have the lip tar. I have the Kior um, glitter. Back here I have my sponge. 
I have the Studio Fix Spray by MAC. I have my Urban Decay Primer. Um, what else? I have the ELF Eyebrow, Eyebrow Kit. Over here, I have a huge bottle of the Benai Banana. Back here, I have like makeup pads. I have extra Anastasia Eyebrow Pencil. I actually have, let me see, so tight. As you can see, the drawer don't come out fully, so you have to like kind of stick your hand back there. I have another Anastasia Beverly Hills Brow Genius Kit. I hardly use this, but when I used it for my wedding and it was awesome. Um, let me just show you guys what comes in it. So that's the entire kit. I, put, I keep that back there because I hardly use it. Um, put this back here. Yeah, these little compartments here, I also got these from Bed Bath & Beyond. Um, they have different sizes. As you can see, they have the big size, they have the little slender size, then I have another big one, then I have a little tiny one on the side. Most of them range from, I think, $3 to maybe 4 to $5. Very cheap, very inexpensive. You kind of get them and sort them the way you want inside a drawer. But this is my beauty section. I keep all my makeup in here. And when I do, I come here, sit, figure out what my look is for the day. And then I sit in front of my mirror and I create perfection. So I just wanted to show you guys that you can have a beauty section without breaking the bank. Okay, ladies, you just pick one little side, little corner somewhere you have like your shoes or some, something that you know, you're not using and you wanna create a little section. You can just get a small desk, make sure you measure the size of your desk, whatever you go, you can get from Ikea or from Target. Uh, you can go online. I'll, I'll have a link below where I got the mirror from. It's a very popular mirror. You get the mirror. The shipment is pretty easy. You get it. You measure it to the desk you buy. You buy this little compartment and you know you set. You have your own little personal beauty section. My husband is so jealous because he says I have this little section for him. and for, I have this little section for me, correction, and he doesn't have a section for himself. So Oh well, the sooner he know, the better he know. This is a woman's world and um, we rule the world. So anyway, guys, I hope you like my video. Uh, don't forget to subscribe. And yes, this is my beauty section, guys. I hope you enjoyed the video. Bye.